County is one of four counties in California in a new pilot program to inform people of pesticide spraying near area farmlands. Action News 8 reporter Phil Gomez has reaction to this pesticide notification program. Phil? Aaron, the five-month pilot program is taking place in three Watsonville senior communities who are asked to sign up for text or email notification through the Santa Cruz County Ag Department. We are the center of the, the test case area, a pilot test. Judy Lazenby is the president of the Pajaro Village Homeowners Association in Watsonville, home to 247 residents all over the age of 55. They have their own pesticide notification program, but welcome the state's new pilot program, which will notify residents 36 hours before spraying. I think this is the most critical time in this whole in this whole program because all the formulation for the program will be based on what the results are here and the other three counties. The pilot program will include the Watsonville senior communities, Pajaro Village, Bay Village, and Pajaro Vista, and a few homes outside that area. The homes are within 30 feet of where pesticide is used. Our program is very specific to certain pesticides. It doesn't include all pesticides. It's very specific to soil fumigants, which is a specific group of pesticides used to fumigate the ground. Strawberries, raspberries, blueberries usually begin ground applications in July, and already some residents have questions. A limited uh, number of chemicals. Uh, it's only for the seniors and not the other neighbors in this community, and the sign-up process is hard to navigate. Santa Cruz, Ventura, Stanislaus, and Riverside counties are taking part in the pilot program. They're not all using the same crops during the notification project, and Santa Cruz County was the last to launch the program this week. We're very pleased that we're making a movement toward um, transparency regarding when pesticides are applied, where, and, and so we're also glad to see that the Santa Cruz Ag Commissioner has stepped up to be one of only four in the entire state that's going to do a pilot project like this. The information gathered from Santa Cruz County and the three other counties could help in the design and implementation of a statewide notification program. In Santa Cruz, Phil Gomez, KSBW, Action News 8.